hi everyone welcome back to my channel and today in this video I'm going to show you how to make a high low waist uh, anarchy top you can make this as a high low waist skirt also so for this project I just took a, a two and a half meter of this crepe color fabric and for the borders I just took this uh, lovely pink so the following measurements you need is the bodice measurement to your waist length and from the waist length you're going to take a uh, uh, below your knee length that's going to be the front side at the back side you're going to take till your ankle length so now let's get started so for the bodice measurement I just took uh, my daughter's old t-shirt so this pattern goes for eight to nine years old kids so first fold the fabric in half like this And fold it again make sure you have all the salvaged edge meets at one side first you're going to cut the waist from the pointy tip so uh, the waist of my daughter is going to be uh, 24 so when I divide the 24 by 4 it's going to be 6 inches just place the tape over this point and measure the 6 inch and you're going to give a mark from year to year and you're going to curl that nice and neat curl like this okay. front side would be 18 inches to so this 6 inches just place it at the center of that and you're going to mark the 18 inches so I'm just going to give a 1 inch for seam elements so that's going to be 19 inches from the top Okay. So just placing on the center point of the waist, uh, you're going to move the tape in order to get a nice and neat circle skirt like this. Okay. So now place the tape again at the waistline and you're going to measure 30 inches from the top. Okay. For seam elements, I'm going to give one one inch. So all together, I'm just marking 31 inches. Okay. So first, cut the back piece, and then you're going to cut the front piece. Okay. of this that is going to be the back piece okay. take the back piece out now we are going to work on with the front piece like this so fold it equal again okay. make sure you matches the exact point as before and you're going to fold that in the fabric like this so now you can see this is going to be the one part of the skirt I took and just placed it at the back and this is going to be the one part of the skirt so from this I'm going to cut out the front part going to be a very good party wear if you're making that in a little bit expensive fabric so now I'm going to make the bodice part and then I'll show you how to attach the borders with the fabric make the borders uh, take the fabric this is going to be the folded edge of the fabric and fold that again like this okay. so 
So now I'm just taking the t-shirt and just folding that again into half. Okay. Make sure the folded edge of the t-shirt matches the folded edge of the fabric like this. Okay. So now you can decide what is going to be the front and the back line. So back neck could be same. I'm just going to just make a slit and I'm going to attach a button to this. Hopefully I'll be doing a boat neck for this. The boat neck is very simple. Same like that. You're going to take the shoulder little bit out and you're going to just curve that like this. This is called the boat neck. Then now I show you how to attach these pieces together. So this is going to be the front part of the skirt and this is going to be the front side of the top. So uh, I'm going to just match both the points together with pin like this. The side of the body should be the pretty side of the skirt. So now I'm going to sew that together. the front side part is attached to the bodice same like that I'm going to attach the next piece so a given notch to the bodice and you're going to match the center point of the skirt to the center point of the top like this and just pin that in place like this Sew that together. The front side is going to have a lovely boat neck, and I just pre made the neckline for this. I'm just placing that on the neckline I'm going to sew that together just pin that in place and then you're going to sew that so this is going to be the pretty side of the fabric so if you want to know how to make an interfacing like this uh, just click on the link below I just made a video of making a neckline with the canvas some notches to turn the fabric so that video is going to be a very detailed video on making this so please do check with that if 
you can't see the link please do uh, check the description box below so all you have to do is just turn the neckline fabric like this and you're going to sew that together same like that I'm going to finish off my back side of the neckline so to the waist I'm going to add this uh, pink and silver lace which goes really well with the dress so I'm going to sew that together So when you do this, the skirt sits very nice and neat. to finish off my neckline Once you are done with the front and the back piece, all you have to do now is you are going to just join the shoulder making sure that the pre sides matches together. So now I am going to join the shoulder. So this is going to be the pre sides. I am just matching the pre sides and I am just sewing that. Once you attach the shoulders together, I am going to make this to be a sleeveless. So I am going to just fold the armhole twice like this and I'm going to sew that together so fold it like this So same like that I'm going to sew to the next side. You're going to match the arm together and you're going to sew the sides.
folded once and you're going to fold that again to finish this off fold that in and just start putting this together so in this way you have a very nice and neat edge result of the dress you can see I just got a very very big flare and it just came out really well so once you're done by sewing the trim you're going to uh, just press that in place so this came out really well it's going to be a nice party wear dress so the color combination also came out really well so if you're going to make like a party wear make sure you take a nice glimpsy little bit expensive fabric for the back so for the skirt part you can just have a just nice flowy fabric so the fabric which flows nice is going to be your skirt part and i totally love this dress so if you like this video please click on the thumbs up button below and do share this video with your friends and don't forget to hit on the subscriber link that you see on the screen right now uh, so that you don't miss any of my future video. So if you're watching through your mobile phone you won't be seeing the subscriber link just click on the subscriber button right below my video. Hopefully my next video would be a cape top. Uh, and a gypsy skirt and an elasticated skirt. I'll be showing all these three in uh, upcoming videos. If you have any requested video, please do send me the pictures in my Facebook page. And thank you so much once again. Take care. Bye bye.